Hi, my name is Adrian and thank you for watching this short introduction to patenting by Albright Patents LLP. If you have an invention, be it a new product or process, then it may well be patentable, allowing you to defend your area of the market. A patent can be a valuable asset. If it is strong, it will keep potential competitors out of your area of commercial interest. It can be used to prevent copycat products coming onto the market and you can ultimately sell or license the patent rights in order to make a profit. To obtain a patent, there are essentially two hurdles to overcome. The first is novelty. This means that your invention must be unique worldwide. Therefore, you must keep your idea confidential until your patent application is filed. This is critical. The second hurdle is inventiveness. This means that your invention must not be obvious. In other words, even though your idea may be unique, if it is a simple design modification without really any inventive ingenuity, then your patent application may fall at this hurdle. So you've decided that your idea is both unique and clever enough, so what's next? Well, the patent specification has to be written in sufficient detail that it really explains the whole inventive concept of your idea in a clear and thorough way. We'll go into this aspect in more detail in a later video. In return for a complete description of your invention and providing you have overcome the novelty and inventiveness hurdles that we mentioned earlier, the government will then grant you your patent. Now, with your patent granted, how long will it actually last? At the end of the day, you want to keep your competitors out for as long as possible. Well, a patent lasts in many territories for up to 20 years from when it was filed. Some countries may differ and some do have different patent options available, such as short-term patents, but not many these days, and for the UK and Europe, the term of a patent is 20 years. So how do you start the patenting process? Well, you should use an experienced chartered patent attorney, such as myself and my colleagues at Albright's. A patent attorney will have an engineering or scientific background, as well as a rigorous legal training. We are regulated by the British government and are members of the Chartered Institute of Patent Attorneys, as well as members of the European Patents Institute. We have a duty to you to act properly, and we will not disclose your invention without your authorization. You will need to disclose your idea to us so we can advise you, but we will keep it confidential. We will discuss the ins and outs of your invention with you, and once we are happy that we really understand the core concept of your idea, the patent drafting process can begin. If you would like to hear more about how to obtain a patent, please watch our further videos in the series, beginning with drafting and filing your UK patent. Many thanks for taking the time to watch this video, and please do contact myself or my colleagues for advice and guidance on patenting.